<laughs> Dude, I didn't know what it was, man. After I found out, I never eat it, chat. Oh my god, you guys are gonna freak out if I show you guys this. <sighs> so, Pandegi is, uh... I used to swim when I was younger, and my dad would pick me up after swim class. And there was a guy in a stand, like one of these right here. And it has a little thingy and a little wheel and there's a hole and he has a bunch of them cooking here. And I remember specifically, he would wrap it with newspaper like this. And you get a bunch of bandegi and he put a little toothpick and you just go Because when you swim, you need, you need to eat, you're hungry, right? And this is what a bandegi is, chat. I didn't know. I was a kid eating. And as I got older, as I got older, I looked at closely what it was. Oh my goodness! They have like eyes and they're like sleeping. You know what? I remember the taste. I can't eat it anymore, obviously. But I remember the taste. It was really good. It was very savory, rich, and very protein. It, it was a good taste. I remember it, but I can't eat it now. I know my brother still eats it, but I can't eat it. Because I know what it is. But when I didn't know and I ate it, dude, it was really good. Lucky, I was a kid, man. I don't know, bro. You eat what your parents feed you, man. Yeah. It wasn't like La Kakarachi. It's like a silkworm. It's, it's not like dirty or anything, I believe. But uh, yeah, it was an insect. I think that's the worst thing I ate, probably. Outside of like raw oyster, I'm not a fan of.